Which is not fun. I love how our Pokemon playthrough has really just devolved into us talking about other games. I'm just I'm just talking about my hatred of the original Mega Man games. Um, I, it's but I, fun. Mega Man X is fun. Uh, there's the Mega Man Zero games on the GBA, which are fun. Mega Man and Bass is not fun. Do not play. I only ever played the first Mega Man X, and I was like, wow, I don't like these games. I, uh, I played a lot of the Battle Network games, as we have talked about before. I think they're yeah. very fun. I, uh, for as many Mega Man games as you have played, like individual Mega Man games, I have beat the Mega Man Legends games that many times. Yeah. Like, it's... I, well, I used to have the, uh, the Mega Man, like, collection on the GameCube. Yeah. And I, I just sucked at it because I couldn't ever fucking beat regular Mega Man. Shit was too hard, dude. I know Mega Man Legends is, like, widely renowned, or renowned for, that's a word, is it renowned, or I guess... I think you're just trying to say regarded. Regarded. Well, it's it's not good. People think it sucks, and I think... People think, quotation yeah, marks. People think it sucks, but I love it. Um, it's one of, like, the defining games of my youth. Because I remember one of my closest friends from my youth would bring it over, and he'd be like, oh, check this out. And I remember just staying up all night, sitting in front of an old CRT TV, playing it on the PlayStation, mm -hmm. and thinking it was the coolest shit ever. And it's not a really long game, and it's a it's a one nighter if you've uh, a one nighter if you ever started a game from start to finish. Now I'll tell you what a uh, what a good game is. You ever heard of a game called Sonic the Hedgehog Two? No, that's a good game. <laughs> I, uh, I played quite a bit of that game, I can tell you that much. That was probably my most played game of all time. Yeah. I remember uh, m my father played with me one time, only one time. I remember though, when I was like four, he played Tails and didn't know what we were doing, and he just got mad and I think he quit the game. But I will never forget that moment. It was a great father-son bonding time with the old pops. Mike is typing. I remember seeing a, uh... Son of a son. Uh, fucking, well... It was me and me, Avery, and my brother. Uh huh. He was like, "Oh, check this shit out." He, like he had his own memory card for Mega Man Legends. He's like, "Check out this shit," and fucking just like what, like beats the final boss without getting hit. I'm like, "How the fuck do you do that?" And Mega Man Juno is so hard. Mega Man Juno. And like, well, spoiler alert: it's Mega Man Juno, who's like some boss you never never see until the end of the game. Mm -hmm. We might play it on the channel. Who knows? If people like if people want to see me play. If you want to see Mega Man Legends, type in Mega Man Legends in the chat. Yeah. If you want to see me geek out over a game, you want to see me fucking fawn over like one of my classic wives. Her name's Tron. If you, the exit. If you know anything about me, it's that A, I love Tron, and B, I want to fucking serve bot tattoo because I love Tron. I don't think uh, he's actually typing. I think he might have accidentally clicked on my thing. <laughs> that happens. Hey, we're in Lavender Town, right? Lavender Town. Isn't that what happens after the rock tunnel? Yeah. It doesn't show him typing anything, so I don't know what's happening. We hikers are natural. Climbing mountains. Climbing mountains. Mountain. 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 Tyler, uh, top five video games ever go. Like, my favorite? Ever. Or, like, actually just the top five good games? Top favorite five games now. So, I mean... The people want to know. I mean, it's, it's, it's a rough one because, I mean, my opinions can change a lot, but uh, I guess top five, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 is number one. Yeah. Uh, this is where it gets hard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, probably, this is the part of the, the fucking channel where it's just, TN this is the TNT podcast where we just talk about shit, and Pokemon is just hanging out in the background. I'm going to probably say Pokemon Emerald is a uh, numero dos. I mean, this is a hard one. I gotta really, I gotta really uh, dig deep. I'll tell you right now, Pokemon isn't even in my top five. I mean, that's fine. It doesn't have to be. Uh, I might have two Sonic games in my top five. <laughs> I think I might have two Resident Evils in mine. Uh, let me think for a second. I mean, yeah, that would probably be that. Uh, my third would be Nightmare in Dreamland, the remake of uh, the Kirby on the GBA. That game is a, mm, it's, it's a masterpiece. I might even put that above Pokemon Emerald. I'm moving that above Pokemon Emerald. Pokemon Emerald's number three. Just had a power shift in the all-time favorite tier list. I mean, they, there's fucking... It's just a beautiful game. If you've never played Nightmare in Dreamland, do yourself a favor. It's a beautiful... Well, well if the people want it... Oh, it's coming on the channel regardless. The it doesn't matter what the people want. It's coming regardless. <laughs> we might just sit around and fuck around and play our favorite games on the channel. I mean, well, I mean, isn't that the point of this? Yeah. 
I mean, we're playing games that are current. I mean... Current and burnt. Games that are fun. People to watch. Fun for the whole family. It's, it's so hard. Number four would probably be Super Mario World. Ooh. Um, what would my number five be? I, I got some games like I, they could be, but like, are they actually? Yeah. Um, let me, let me think about it for a second. You, let's just keep walking, battling trainers. I'll think about it. Okay. I'll give it a, give it a good old thanky, a thunk, if you will. No, I got it actually. <laughs> this one's going to be a little bit out of left field, but, uh, Fire Emblem Awakening. I love that game. So do I. Probably not in my top five. It's in my top five. I it uh, honestly changed my views on games. That's how how big it was to me. I have a game like that in mind. It was a, uh, I I just remember kept wanting to play because I never played a Fire Emblem game before besides like a torrent I think I had for the GameCube one, which I wasn't good at. It's a uh, hint that Awakening's much easier than uh, the older games. <laughs> well, I mean the they were hard, but like. You go. You play Fire Emblem games be because they're hard. Yeah, I remember I was I, I was talking to Josh. Uh, and we were skyping it up because that's what we did every single night. We'd Skype for like four hours and just talk to each other, as a, as you do with your bros. Yeah. And uh, it was like two in the morning. I was like, I'm gonna buy this game. I've been wanting to play it. Uh, I didn't go to bed until seven a.m. I played remember, it for like five hours straight. I remember Fire Emblem Awakening coming out while I worked at GameStop and being so mad that we didn't have enough physical copies. Yeah. And like that was the worst like. I'd ever felt buying a game digitally. It was like, I need to play it, but I want to buy it physically. It is such a good game. And I, uh, it was the game that I, I told, I bought Scott a 3DS to play the game. Because <laughs> I was like, you need to play this. And he loved it. It's honest, I mean, I've played through that game so many fucking times. It's a, it's a fantastic game. Anyways, Tyler, it's time for your top five. Wait, run down your five for me one more time. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Yeah. Nightmare in Dreamland, Pokemon Emerald, um, Super Mario World, and then Awakening. Awakening's number five. Okay. So, if if you know anything about me. If you if you know anything about me, yeah, number anything, one number is one. A, uh, as a game, it's it's got a four in it. Yeah, it's got a four in it. <laughs> it's Resident Evil 4. I was trying to think of a funny game with a four in it, but yeah. I fucking couldn't. Um, Could have made like a joke about Jin from League, but you don't know who Jin is, so. No. Um, sure, we will know. That's all that matters. I could have said sure for the, the, the Overwatch guy. But, yeah, I'd rather you not. Um, but no, I fucking love that game. I have so much fucking emotional like attachment to the game. Yeah, yeah. Um, I played it like right when I like my eyes were awoke like a. Awoke. I was woke to video games. He was awoken. I was awoken to it. I, I had my fucking awakening to video games. I was like, wait a second. This is a good video game. Wait, this is what video games are? Yeah, and I've... Like, I even fuck. I sent you a Snapchat of me playing it the other day. Like, I still go back and play that game. I have it on, like, every system it's ever I mean, I play on. Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Like, Stop avoiding thunder! I play Sonic the Hedgehog 2, like, all the time. It's got a 70% accuracy. Of course, huh? it's gonna avoid it. It's not 100%. Oh. You know what it is? Zippy Zap. Um, but yeah, I fuck. I remember playing that game on a, an old CRT TV because that's all my mom had in her fucking living room. And she would watch me play it. And I remember she'll never let me live it down. Like, the first time I died in that game was, like, the promotional artwork of Leon getting his fucking head chopped off by a chainsaw. Uh -huh. And she, she, like, you want to talk about Trivi's boyish laugh. I had a girlish scream. <laughs> um, but man, I fucking love that game. I'm super excited for it. I like every time I talk about porting it to a new console, I I'm like, I gotta get it. Like, you gotta do it. It's just that good. If you've never played Resident Evil before, fucking look out for my playthrough of that game on the fucking channel because we're it's gonna coming. we're gonna do a fucking salmon run. Spoiler alert. Look up salmon run. Yeah, it, and don't get confused with the shitty fucking mini game in Splatoon too. Side note too, even though Sonic the Hedgehog 2 is my favorite Sonic game, Sonic Mania is actually the best Sonic game. But <laughs> nostalgia, you know, you know, nostalgia is one hell of a drug. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog 2 is my uh, the reigning king. Um, so number two, that's a tough one. No, it's not. It's Breath of the Wild. <laughs> it's easy. I didn't even have to think. No, it's that's a tough one again. It's I'm torn between 
one and no, I'm gonna say the one I played first. It's Persona Three. Okay. Persona Three is I like. I admittedly I gotta put that over. Cause that that kind of helped too. Cause I remember fucking. Oh god, I'm using a pinch. I like you had you said like Awakening was like your fucking like Awakening. That like yeah. I mean same with Persona or Resident Evil Four. I mean like I just the game is just so good. It it doesn't have like a super like relatable plot but it's just like you get fucking so invested in the story yeah and it's like like where the other persona games are more about like the revolving or like the the reoccurring theme is just like fucking pronounced friendship like there's a certain level of like independence like somebody would just be like oh i'm not gonna go to the dungeon with you because i have real life shit to do my dad died i can't they're not like oh we gotta fucking do this because the game wills it. It just has a lot more depth. And it's just cool because it's... Uh, I know my friends don't like the the degree of uh, difficulty of you can't control your characters. But I think it's pretty cool. It does sound pretty cool. Um, third one, obviously, is Breath of the Wild. I have a fucking tattoo um, from Breath of the Wild. I have to fucking make sure because people it's, don't it's know It's <sighs> Go on. <laughs> Um, obviously Mifa, I love that character to death. Uh, the game is just so great. I mean, obviously a fucking one game of the year. Um, you can just do whatever the fuck you want in that game. Um, number four, it would, it would have to be a Star Fox game, but I don't know which one it would be. But do you want to learn agility? No. You want to be Assault? It would, no, it would be Star Fox 64 for the 3DS. Oh, yeah. Because that's, like, the best version of that game. Because they have fucking updated graphics, so it doesn't look like shit. True. And they still have the original voice actors doing, like, a new cut of all the same dialogue. I need to fucking save. Not save, heal. Yeah, we're, uh, we're running a little low. Number four? Well, I thought that was number four. Number five? Um, <laughs> it would probably be... Hmm. Alright, Dylan, you gotta go fucking save your dying two bone. Um, I don't know, was it a Rattata or it's a Raticate? Well, that's, that what, same... that's what Gary's is. Oh, it's not but... the same plot. Okay. Um, my fifth one would probably be. It's either Shadow of the Colossus. No, it's not Shadow. Uh, that'll be number six. My fifth one is Turtles in Time. Solid pick. No, it's not. <laughs> It's Mega Man Legends. <laughs> How could I forget? <laughs> no, it's not. All right, what is it, Tyler? It's you know, it's Mega Man Legends. Okay. I love that game. Like it has that. That's all of mine are such like fucking ingrained with a certain amount of like fucking nostalgia. Other than like fucking Breath of the Wild because that just came out almost two years ago. It's not weird to say. Yeah, but I mean, it's it just fucking. It's just a good game. I still play the game. I have fucking over a hundred hours in it. There's just so much to do. You, you, there's never a dull moment. No. All right, top five GBA games. Final Fantasy five, five times. <laughs> Easy. No, it would be. That's where I would actually put a Pokemon game. Um, number one. Fucking Final Fantasy five. Obviously. Easy. Um, because that's the, like the only way we could play the game in America. Fire Red probably after that. I thought that was so cool. It was a, like a good remake. The, I just liked playing Pokemon games with my brother because he's like the big fucking the Pokemon Stan, and I would just play him with him. Um, third one, I honestly fucking couldn't even tell you. I that's like my Game Boy experience was Final Fantasy V and Pokemon. Uh, uh, well, no, Star Fox Command was on the DS. I was going to say, I played that. My numero uno would be uh, Nightmare in Dreamland. Coming back again uh, on the other list. Um, uh, I'd probably put number two, Superstar Saga. Hey! <laughs> it's time! Uh, Superstar Saga, number two. Uh, 
Pock Emerald. Pock Emerald. Be number three. Yeah. Uh, I actually played a lot of uh, Golden Sun on the GBA. Oh, fuck. I played uh, Sacred Stones. That's on there. Yeah. I've never played that one. Played a lot of Golden Sun, though. Isaac and Smash confirmed. That's just what you want. I don't want Isaac and Smash at all, actually. That's just what you want. That's just what you want, but it's not going to happen because it can't. Why is Growlithe such a low level? Uh, Because we haven't been using him. But, I mean, we haven't been using Sandshrew. Yeah, but he was in the party before Growlithe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What was that? Number uh, three? That was four. What would my fifth one be on the uh, the Gibba? I didn't play a whole lot of Game Boy Advance games. It's probably going to be uh, one of the Battle Networks. Probably number two. Number two Battle Network. It's a classic. You can't beat it. I'm trying to fucking think about uh, enough games. You don't play games, Tyler. That's the problem. No. You're a fake gamer. Gamer it's, grill. It's wait, good. wait. We can ride on Arcanine now. But doesn't that gear to you? Where am I at? How do you... How Hello? You... Bring me back. Where am I? I don't know. What's happening? Where am I? How do I ride? Oh, do I, I have to take him out, don't I? Yeah, well, he's already out of the thing, but I don't know where I'm at. Put him back in and then take him out. I don't know. It says take out, so we must not have him out right now. There we go. Now Mew's gonna be gone. That's what it is. Now you can ride him. <laughs> where am yeah, I at? Yeah. Oh, whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. A wild jiggly. Why did I die? Did my controller die? What's happening here? You're gone. Bring me back. We're having technical difficulties. Bring me back to hey. life. Hey, let me get on there. Oh, look Yo. at that. Rolling around at, at the speed of sound. sound. Gotta That's cut cute. this bitch. Wait, we gotta fight this bitch. Hey. Catch a lot of Pokemon out here, so buzz off. Is that like your private fucking... Buzz off, you buzzer. This isn't your fucking private property, bitch. I need to see a permit. Look at that wave right there, the gesture. Kyla. What kind of name is Kyla? Get out of here with your Byla. Alright, Tyler. Top five favorite games you would recommend to somebody who's never played them. Wouldn't that just be your top five favorite games? No. Would you recommend somebody play fucking... Well, I guess, actually, yeah. Now that I think about it. Now that I sit on it. Because, I mean, oh, we were just talking. Wait, you're fucking... Your clothes changed. No, they didn't. Yeah, they did. You were wearing a blue skirt before. I don't know, was it? Yeah, you were. No. You matched me. No, You I matched don't. me. We're twins. No, I'm not. That's cool. Nothing changed, Tyler. Yeah, it did. You didn't see anything. Shut up. <laughs> Stop talking so highly. Wow. <laughs> you would say that to me? No, I'm talking to myself. Oh. Um, but I, oh, take down. Um, you've been taking. Big old gal. Taking down the, taking down the pound town. I'd let Chansey take me to Pound Town with her banana feet. What are you getting rid of? Take down or pound? Pound? You kidding me? I guess we can softball it if we hurt ourselves. Um, well, no, now that I think about it, I guess the same subjects, or the subjects are kind of synonymous. Um, Top three villains from any video game. Tron. <laughs> Is Tron really the villain, though? Depending on the game, yeah. I guess. I figured you would have picked, like, Ganon or something. <laughs> right. You have a Zelda tattoo! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I guess. Um, but, I, I mean, Ganon is kind of meh in Breath of the Wild. He's just, like, an overarching fucking villain. He doesn't really have any direct impact. I mean, I guess. Holy shit! That looked like it hurt. That's a lot of damage! Zippy zap, I was ticking a zip. Uh, so, fucking Tron would be number one. Right. Even though she kind of, like, evolves in more of, like, a fucking anti-hero. But she still has fucking... She's still got the guts. Yeah, she still fucking tries to make money in her own game. Um... I can respect the hustle. Would you count... Mmm... I want to say the bad guy in Persona 3, but I don't know. It, first of all, it's a fat spoiler. Um, so the, I'm just going to say the bad guy in Persona 3. Wow, I run so fast with this shit. Jesus Christ. Um, get along, little doggy. Why do I, like, get off? Because you ran I'm, into her. I'm by a fucking lady. Yeah. 
Um, I'm a rambling gaming dude. I'm a rambling man. And then I'm fucking Bowser, probably. You took Bowser? Yeah. Voice acted Bowser in Sunshine? Oh, no, I'm talking voice actor Bowser in Odyssey. Mario. Oh, Mario. <laughs> I'm taking a bath. Dude, that is like top five boss battles of all time. Don't at me. We're going to have to start a countdown the uh, fucking playlist. <laughs> You tell me you didn't like doing Top the Top five polarizing opinions you land on the polarizing side of. I pronounce it... You won't believe number four. I pronounce it jam over jelly. <laughs> I, I can't jelly my dick into you. I pronounce it spread <laughs> instead of jelly. Spread this... Miss the big chance. Mm. No. God, fucking grape spread. Who could forget... Rolling around at the speed of sound. So if I had two Arcanines, would you ride on an Arcanine too? Probably not. That would be fucking cool, though. I'm just rolling around. Why do you fucking keep going away? I don't know. My guy's just freaking out, dude. Now, did we do the fucking Lavender Town thing before we fight Erica? No, we don't have to. Okay. Well, we got I also Arcanine. don't think we have enough time to battle Erica. All right. Well, we can just stop now. We healed up. We fucking people. We, we talked healed up. We build up. We field up. We caught some pokes. We fucking We got Arc. We talked about our favorite we games. We talked about the games. We did the things. And, uh... Yeah, I feel like it's a good place to stop. Feels like it's a... It's we a evolved thing. Growlithe. We got a big boy now. Look at this. Here, I'm gonna come in. Look at me. Here, hold on. I know what we can do. We'll test this. We'll we'll go back to the when we first started this session. Check this out. What? Pokemon box. What, are you gonna evolve another Growlithe? No. We don't have another Firestone. Oh, Persian. Yeah. You would do that to Sandslash? That'll come back. It'll come back. I don't, I don't think you can take out two Pokemon, though. But That's it follows problem. you. I don't have anything following me. Because, yeah, the Pokemon that... I don't know. It's, it's, it ain't working, Chief. Oh, so wait, if I take out... If you take out Persian... You'll have the thing that's behind like that in the slot? They probably made it so you can't have what you want to happen because the Switch can't handle three Pokemon being on the screen. Yeah, so you have Chansey now. So yeah, I was right. So it's like you can only have only... Yeah, so I couldn't have any Pokemon out because the next one would have been Persian. Yeah. And I would have had to ride Persian. And they didn't make an animation Damn. for it. They've thought of everything. Janucci Masuda. He does it again. Doing, doing a cuddle. Well, that was fun. We beat we beat Lieutenant LT Surge. R.I.P. We got thirty Pokemon. Elisa Trevor, Surge. Lisa Trevor. It's a Resident Evil reference. I don't know what the fuck it is. <laughs> Maybe next time we'll change Pikachu's clothes. Did you even clothes. save? Uh, uh, probably. I'll save again though. I don't think you did. I think I did. I don't think you, I don't think you pressed it. Yeah. See, you saved your progress. There you go. All right, we're done. Bye, bye, boys. Later.